And with that, I welcome you all to Hello Charlotte, episode one. The first game of the Hello Charlotte series, <laughs> which disclaimer, I have uh, no idea what will be happening here. Like, I saw a few fakes, a few fakes, but I don't remember any of them. So, uh, yeah, blind playthrough here for Spooky Day. My world met its end a long time ago. The humanity as I knew, it has ceased to exist and disappeared without a single trace. The gods they believed in have died and churches were built as their graves. The chaos turned into order and it finally became quiet. All I can do is dream for I am so so tired. Before I abandon the words that form noise in my head, will you be so kind as to join me in dream seeing? Hello, Charlotte. Episode 1 Chunk Food, Gods, and Teddy Bears. Hey, I, I don't know how this correlates with each other. Hello, Charlotte. Nice to meet you. Please take care of me. Um, okay. This is my room. Better mini room about the lectus. It's quite modern, don't you think? I mean yeah. Let's go to to the dining room. I'm hungry. Also, a little something here. The first off, um I think I should have said it in the disclaimer. It's getting a lot of spooky. <laughs> like spook gory. I should rather say. So uh yeah. Band-aids, scalpels, notes, tea bags, everything is such a mess. I don't want to sleep yet. Current user has to restrict the access to the data on the cube. So, current user has to get access to the tele. What? Is a log in. Log might be useful. Look out for puppeteer symbols. Only the users with X in their names have access to all doors. Oh, okay. Corridor. Dining room. The last time I tried to cook something, the world was almost destroyed by the food monster. Oh! I wish Bennett didn't put his chemicals on the shelves along with the sugar and the salt. First of who is Bennett and what's a fish? Soap old thing. Not even our dining room doors would have anything edible. Some table board inside. Table board there. Here, Charlotte. I'll be home late. Call 0800 to order food from Charlie's. From Charlie's. Hugs and kisses, ma'am. This note is eight months old. My parents work on holidays. No task, crazy. Order food. Okay. The house. Basement. The section room. What? Tailoring room. Okay, test room. Marine bottle. Ground floor. Living rooms. Aha. Uh -huh. Puppet menu, okay. The puppet control menu has four options. Stuff, tasks, rewind, poems, exit. It, stuff is the inventory task is, okay, what what I should do. Rewind points is probably loading and exit as well. Chunk is stuff we throw away. Stuff is chunk we keep. Tasks are daily life quests. Rewind points contain save data of previous events. And B should be used only if the puppet dies or if the puppeteer must leave the control console. Actually, it should not be an option for a responsible puppeteer. There's no one about secret. Yep, the puppeteer's this guy. Okay. No, non types, Seth type, Love type. 
Male, female? Live in true realm. Pick, pick. Purpose, control, and direct. Assigned to humans only, probably. NB can rewind time when the puppet dies. The observers. World government members. Wear animal skulls, mask. Non representatives. Umbrella man. The puppets. Also known as humans. Wait, what? Live in false realm. Purpose. To err. To err. Mm -hmm. Non representative. Me, mom, dad, classmates. Not so sure. Actually, the aliens pretend to be human to cause less ruckus. Live in false realm, non representative Huxley, Bennett, Aiden, politicians. Okay, TV room. Watch two good commercials. Uh, next on penetration, the means is familiar. Commercial, don't miss it. No, enough TV for the yes. Wasn't dark yesterday. Library. X69, okay. Maybe the just making made easy, fancy fall, sort of napkin from in his bookshelf. I find it cute. Uh huh, now with more recipe, kaboom, advanced fear making video for example. Venice stage just scream danger and geek. <laughs> but full of literature in alien language. I can't read the tiles. The nerd law my fairy son, oh, this is mother's shelf, she loves her and books. Not obtained. I'll discuss you as a human. Ah Golden apples of the sun. This is uh, my humble. Hey, it's Charlie's organic chunk foods. Please place your order. Um, I'd like to order eco-friendly chicken nuggets and then instant diabetes soda, please. What the fish? I mean, eco-friendly chicken nuggets? Okay, it's understandable. But instant diabetes soda? I'm not so sure. I shouldn't be so nervous when talking into a machine. Thank you for ordering a choice. Stay healthiest with us. Where is... Okay, um... Where is food? Since our user data and monitoring user must not be turned off. Well, it is expected to follow the absolute rules embassy. Bodily, bodily injury, including dismemberment, mental disturbances, or other harm to the user's well being caused by infringement of the rules listed above. However, <laughs> omnipotent cubes are multitask devices that allow for transmit, duplication, creation, or disintegration of organic matter and the storage of data. We should not put liquid soap inside on the cubes, as it might cause unforeseen consequences to happen. And then, we choose a category to read current users of seven. Yet to complete the educational program. Those better using hobbies include sewing and text. A surgeon who wants to enter the National Clinic on the second floor using not once or very boxes of duct tape for unknown purposes. I don't want to uh, say it, but uh, hey, this guy is looking kind of sus. User not Bennett is the name of the on the badge on his office passport suit. Okay. Dining room. Where food? Wait. Magic word is please. Understandable, sorry. Find a way to go to the attic. Oh, 
it please please what the nice color access granted hallway nothing in it here A strange hissing noise is coming from behind the door. Me to open it? I don't know. Um, don't hurt gun now, it should be safe. Like a meal was on, you better return to the dining room. Uh huh. Chicken nuggets are vegetables too. Okay, I accept this. What a mockery of real food. Is it all they can offer these days? You should try wallpapers, dear child. They are especially rich in iron. I'm scared. Don't listen to him. The soap is much better in nutrition. Um, guys, do I get a say in this? Aliens don't really have a concept of personal space, do they? By the way, Mr. Aiden, the door to the ground floor corridor doesn't open. It's closed for minor construction works. Nothing to worry about. Come out at night, you might find something interesting there. Mm, nope. Aiden pinches. Ow. Stuff giving the child weird ideas. Don't listen to him, dear girl. If you want to join in, I'll be watching Soapnet in the TV room. What? What? Soap Oprah's just call for soap milkshakes. What is wrong with this guy? What is his fascination on soap? And at least. Almost forgot. Come to the dis dissection room later. I have a favor to ask of you. Actually, if you. Okay. Why? He's. Ah. Okay, and, and now, uh. Um. Not supposed to. Four, of course. Four, of course. If you're free to make that statement, then it's correct. You may pass. What the fish is wrong with? Unlock the door. Open me. Yep, this seems fishy, although I'm still curious. Yeah, and some tools are inside, some tools are stored inside. Filled with fabric. Filled with fabric. If a butler in a white space has his own room where he has a lot of clothes, especially woman clothes, it is either he's a professional tailor but has being a butler as a side thing, or he's a massive creep and should be not be interacted with at all. Like a white dress. Oh god. Read this. Well, next to it. Aha. Uh -huh. In no order, even his mannequins are in place. I'm Satan, being a busy boy as always. Hello, dear girl. There's a dress I want you to try on, if you don't mind. I'd love to. I put on the dress that Taylor made. Oh, it's, it's really cute, really. Wow, it's totally rad. It's called White Spotted Jellyfish Dress. Mm. It still needs a few finishing touches. I'll give it to you when it's ready. The process is not Okay. Okay, now. 
open the box. Suddenly everything collapsed into a singularity. Sun indestructible in less than a second. But I can add yes. <laughs> Wait a moment, do I have to... Okay. God, it opens the door. There's a giant cock... No, find it. God, it's healthy chunk of food's delivery. Please sign here. Okie dokie. Gotta make my signature beautiful. Just, just a large X on the paper. Nailed it. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed the rest of your day. The delivery man hits his pulse lightly and leaves. So, don't open the singularity. Saving. Do it yourself, heart massage. Everything you wanted to know about string theory, here to ask. Selfish gene, bad signs, the man who mistook his wife for a hat. Oh, funny, some books I've read. Red. Carving him embrace you in a peacock. Push your history. Do if your daughter brings some the rape. What if your daughter brings home uranium? You know, you know that stuff, the radioactive stuff that. It is also used in at atomic bombs. Yeah, what about what, uh, what happens? Yeah, I, I want to read this, please. Well, I don't know, access in it. Okay. Well, man, weird out of nowhere when I was a child. When I was in kindergarten or in the library with mom or alone in my room, he was always there, watching me with his yellow eyes from the darkest corner of the room. Not uttering a single word. When I tried to tell mother about him. He lifted a finger to his lips. As if not wanting me to speak. So I didn't. In my book of truth I called him the observer. As soon as I, as I defined him. The man spoke for the first time. Oh. Oh. That name is not bad I must say. He remarked. However, wouldn't anyone who watches over you become an observer? I had to agree. Hmm, then I'll call you the Umbrella Man. Slightly taking it back, the man coughed. Ahem, although I would have preferred a more euphonic name, let it stay this way. Since then I gave every new person I met in the house a distinctive name. Is it just me or do I have slightly candle wipes here? Mom asked who I was talking to. I didn't tell her about the umbrella man. Instead, I told a lie. Birthday. On the day of my 10th birthday, the doorbell rang in the middle of the night. A masked man wearing a top hat and a black suit was standing behind the door. Hello, little Charlotte, he said with the smile of a man who offers children candies. And her mother told me not to talk to strangers. I answered in a determined voice. That's out of sign. I am no stranger to you. Human memory is so ephemeral, isn't it? Even if I do know you, you must be a bad guy, I insisted. Me? Bad? Why so? I had to come up with something. That's because all villains were top hats. I mean, she's not wrong there. Oh, is that so? What a silly pretty... But juice, the man commented with a small laugh. Don't let this appearance fool you. Those words he took off the mask. As I thought, the man was none other than the brother man himself. Although I'd love to have a chat with you on your significant day of the year, I came for another reason. Put on my head, curious. Listen closely, little one. I came to inform you that a puppeteer has been assigned to you since you've reached the age of 10. Is this somehow kind of related to Pokemon? Who is that? They are a representative of the true realm, designed specifically to watch over your troublesome species. The one assigned to you is a Seth type 
puppeteer. As for the purpose, they are here to guide you, the puppets, throughout your short lives. Why would they do that? You feel a one. Free will is fiction. I chewed on my words, trying to come up with a smart reply. Ah, this choice of words must have been too difficult for a child. Let me put it another way. Meet your new friend, who will watch over you. Their name is Seth. Don't bully them too much, okay? Being just out of soap pipe. Bennett is too much focused on soap. What is wrong with this guy? <laughs> Sorry, but this is this is not an attack against anybody who actually attacks soap. It's just if you're too fixated on soap and soap alone, then then we have a slight weird problem here because it is okay if you attack just if you attach yourself to something, but uh, soap, just soap. Just soap. Soap only. You are a soap only guy. You wash yourself with soap, of course. You eat soap alone. You read Bibles of soap. Why? So, your son is an alien. How to raise your IQ by watching soap operas. I'm not sure about the usefulness of the second pussy. Only guy to country in the universe. Four hundred twenty-five fifth bell proof edition. Ah, huh? cannibal man set free. Human name encyclopedia. The complete clinical surgery for dummies. Uh, doesn't I mean easy to die from? Okay, retina scan. Okay, and also retina scan. Eve? So he's busy dissection, dissecting a corpse, bros, if it was human once. Hey, Dr. Huxley. Hello, little Charlotte. How was that little talk we had earlier? Can you do me the favor of looking after my lovely nephew for a couple of days? I've been so busy working on the cure for eye plague that I can't keep an eye on him at all. Good joke, good joke, good joke, good joke, good joke, good joke, good joke. But also, what? Well, I know. Oh, no. He could be collecting rare specimens in broad daylight right now. He's too passionate for his own good. Are you too passionate for your own good yourself? The main reason why I'm worried about him, however, is that he has no sense of direction, you see. Ah. You may have a bad attitude, but don't let that guide to you. Okay, I'll help. Felix, come here. Ugh, I don't need anyone to look after me, Uncle Huxley. Right, right. Also, where the fish did you come from? Where the fish did you come from? Like, you, you were your own. Right, right. Now go play with your new big sister. Uncle has signs to do. Mm, he has signs like the good father from Mad Father, who also did some science. There he goes again. It's nice to meet you, Felix. I'm Charlotte. Hi. If you want to make it through the day, don't you dare invade my personal space. Oh, I can almost feel this cloud burning into my skin. This is going to be a long day. There's a section tomorrow. New task is you've killed time. Oh. Also, wait. Wait, can I? Right here. Uh, this, so this is where Ben's crew work. Much stuff usually blows up in here, so it has restricted access. It's Franklin. His name is Baldwin. And John Ned. Watching. I'm always considering a possibility of being watched. It's pretty possible if we take into account all the conspiracy theories. 
Because you've already known the suit label. Hector. Franklin. Hello, Florence. What's up? We've discovered that adding dark matter to the dough proves the taste of a chocolate cake by 15%. Hector, what? Don't tell anyone. Okay, okay. The suit label. Okay. Okay, can 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 thank you. Don't hunt here. Uh... Okay, good to know. There's two friends. Uh... Okay, let's just. I can open these. What's this squishy? A specimen for research and an organ supply. Look, but do not touch. Understandable. Have a good day. What the fish was this giant thing? Move aside, the uh, door scans the bodies. Why is I? One door out of three leads to death. You enjoyed the, the, the what? Hope you enjoyed the Monty Hall room. Door and die. So I think get a price. Well, is this for real? Want to check? Nothing happens, I'll be done, yeah. Ah. Yes, I would like to click. What? Yes. Got an Azure ribbon. Oh, oh cute. Um. Very busy. Okay. First floor. Okay. Where is this lead? So you and your curse are fine. I'll open it. Oh, we're in outer space. Set aside. Yep. Want something nice? Take it. Then Helix Nebula ownership. Wow. I hereby proclaim myself the Empress of the Helix Nebula. How does that sound? Utterly really cheesy. Okay. Bennett looks sad. Hi, Bennett. Are you dead or something? After 1037 episodes and 10 specials, they finally confessed their undying love to each other. My God. Underneath my protection suit, I'm dying from complicated feelings. Let's leave him until he's ready to return to the harsh reality, shall we? Well, Big Sis is going to sleep. How about you? Do not require sleep. A crap a bottle will soap and measure your brain waves while you sleep, stupid human. Ah. Sounds like a plan. I suppose I don't have to accompany you, uh, you to the bathroom. No way in hell. Go to sleep already. Good night. One point. Uh, uh, yes. Safe, so everything should be well. I'm off to bed. Good night. Good night, Seth. Something slimy cross into the room. Ah. I don't try to hide under the bed sheets. Oh, hey, my cat. You've scared my puppeteer here a little. One day, my cat turned into a maggot, or was he a maggot all along that turned into a cat? Ah, uh, wow! Well, the my cat 
updates as it makes himself comfortable in my lap. Good, good cat. Our pets to my cat, it purrs. Shaw falls asleep peacefully. One more settled. Yes, my ears too. It literally scared me right now. <laughs> no joke. Felix promised to come back soon too. Did he get lost in the house? Or we go look. Consider taking pepper strip. Yes. Please be careful. You're such a merry man. Uh, fine, Felix. Uh -huh. Out of security reasons. Ah. Oh. The unknown room. The cover glass is missing. Go in. This could uh, couldn't have gone in here, could he? What is this? I don't remember how I was having a door pass to a princess castle. Be anything. To we'll find what you need upstairs. Oh, I wonder why are the birds anywhere? These toys are kind of cute. Turning is falling, the old bear is crawling. Okay, good. Then he didn't do anything. I'm. S good to skinning and. Cutting Homo sapiens cooking with passions. Mmm, cannibal. Just a little, another thing scary at all. And we go a little that he wants to play. Mmm, ah, pop, 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 pop. I will never go into this room ever again. Thank you very much. I got the guide. And the Lepidalia. It is. Go straight to the left. Oh, papa boy. Hold the rope, yes. Go back to the right. The let's go. Yes. And safe. So. Oven, some vegetables. And that's. Oh, hi. The little girl's eye will up with you at the side of Charlotte. Um, I'm very sorry. Can I help you? Come on. Are you lost? Aren't you lost yourself, big sister? That hurt. Leave. Rhea doesn't talk to strangers. Okay, it's locked. Someone's fascination with bears. Lovely honey. I will not touch those dolls. Good. Okay. Because I said of the side of the rabbit hole. I mean to give it to you, I can have it. Sure, here you go. Thank you. I still like egg whites. I'll take that as a compliment, I guess. I'm looking for a little boy. He must have lost his way in this place too. Seen him by any chance? No, there's no one but Freya. I see, you must be very lonely. Huh, Freya is fine on her own anyway. Get lost already if you're not going to stay. Thank you, sound. Ah. 
I you don't the red line the Take a break. Bear room. I hope there aren't any extra bears out there. Cat room. I'm saving just a uh, in case. The bear of the key shall pass. I just wanted to say, go to the kit room. Drink from the right cup. Okay. The left cup. Those are pretty... The cats do not tell lies. Uh, it's don't tell lies. Safe in just in case. Ah, so. to the bar room guard me from the shells those are my favorite And the left fireplace. <sighs> I got the ring. So, okay. I figured. Uh, um, I've uh, obtained none of So, for the book, yes. Oh, for it. That's the trooper. Okay. So, walk around. Yeah, there's a small bear, a middle sized bear, and a great. Eat the porridge. Old clock sound. Who even uses it anymore? This horrible place. I assume it's as you find. Okay. 
Exit, yep. in here I don't even so burglar wait you're punished in they can't get neighbors right also the torture they didn't mean that uh, the torture in this room doesn't look any different from the other stuff Problem with the program doesn't mean I can, but I won't. No, I simply can't access me one minute. Oh, well, okay. Um. Is it worth to say that I don't like this? Hello? Alex? You? Aren't you? Don't worry, Pixis is here to help. We can't brief. Stop this erosion, display of affection, this is Small talk aside, how did you get here? I uh, got lost in your house? That's no way I'm buying that. Anyhow, we need a plan. I'm not going to sit around and wait until... As for crappy taxes. Yes, what are you talking about? Are you captured by them too? Excuse me? Just got here and I have no clue what are you talking about. Anyhow, you really needn't have followed. Happens on you at all? Only books. The physic in swallows. Excuse me while I slam my... Uh, and against my forehead. Good thing met up before you could get into more trouble. Fine, fine. I get it. Sorry for being a burn. Well, there is nothing you can do about it now. Still, what are you really doing here? Well, the high probability of an oracle who has taken physical form appearing in this dimension, such as such an occurrence happens once in several millennia. Oracle, what's that? For you, they are equal to gods in short. They are entities capable of creating small universes. I won't go into details for now, it is not like your puny brain would comprehend it all. Excuse me? It sounds like fun. What's the security drone, presumably? Huh? Want something that's ticket? It is creeping around it. No, we just have. Hi. There is missing a doorknob. Let's look around. In a silent film. Um, hello. Lies are written in capital letters. See no evil, speak no evil, hear no evil, have no fun. Ah. Better not. I will just. 
Holy. Didn't play cool. Ah. I don't... Okay. Uh. Wonder what what happens to the journalist in Bark. Okay, but this one is weak. Okay. Oh, hi, yeah, hi, 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 yeah. I want to see what's in here. Once upon a day, I left the tiny thing. The tiny got created, and tiny was filled with tiny people. Tiny people create more tiny people and tiny things engage in tiny walls and begin tiny paths of dull. <coughs> what? Plus one is free. Ah. And it says don't read, so I don't read it. Knock, knock. Who there? Okay. Ray. Ah. Ah, uh, I said nothing. Sorry, but yes, I see. Thank you very much. Oh, oh no, good. Yes, yeah, this is okay. Let's open the door. Yes, dive. <sighs> Then. Sorry, but yeah. Axe fishing, just me. His head. Huh, this can't be, can we do something? It's no use. No matter what you do, I'll end up dying here in one way or another. Who are you? Poor right person that's out to laugh. Stop making that face. It doesn't suit you. I'm a librarian, but you see, nobody comes to read anymore. Anyhow, there's no use crying over that meat. <laughs> I think we're dead meat. Real dead meat. You're dead meat! Go ahead and laugh, you guys. The final, final little passes of business. They're dead meat. Ha. Huh. How could you? I promised to look after him, yet. There, dear. Not all is lost. Aside from this person's head, I guess. Wait, wait. Don't hit me for, for that. What do you su suggest I do then? Switch the channel. That's all. How would that help me? You'll see for yourself. Perhaps you'll get lucky enough to change history. 
Why should I trust you? I'm not telling you to do something unthinkable, am I? Besides, I'm quite knowledgeable about how this place works. Ah, sorry, I'm enjoying myself too much. It's the first time I've talked to an actual person in years. The door's open. Aren't you in a hurry? Right. Goodbye then. Bye bye. Be careful if you meet the executioners on your way. They won't be nice like me. <coughs> that what? Oh, yeah, right, I can. Hmm, wait, what? Felix? You? Is it really you? What kind of question is that? Of course it's me. I just got here. Is that so? Hey, what are you crying? Oh. Oh. Hey. Stop that. A lot, let's go. Just glad you're safe and sound. Felix sighs. Is that so? Anyhow, you did not have to follow me. Finish Felix's. But you need to look after you, dummy. Don't underestimate me and my amazing care caretaker skills. But you were going to scold me for running off. You came here for a reason, right? I won't scold you. Just stay safe. Yeah, I guess. You're acting weird. You're imagining things. Take my hand so that we won't get separated, okay? <laughs> Absolutely. And. Objections allowed, as Seth likes to say. Oh. Maybe. Oh, there. There. Hi. See you. Huh? Thanks for earlier. It really did work, the switching the channel thing. May I ask? Do I know you? You don't... Remember me? I believe it's the first time we've met. Uh, I'm really sorry. I must have mistaken you for someone I knew. That's no surprise. We all must look the same to you. I'm very sorry. To apologize. Is there a book you need to find? Perhaps I can be of assistance to my fellow bibliophiles. I do my best to keep everything in order in here, you know? Rather than a book, it's there a safe exit. All access here are safe. It's a library, after all. Uh, is that so? Yes, you'd like to ask? Uh, I was just curious why it's so empty in this library. Ah, about that. Well, you see, this library is the last one in the world. The moment my people enter this place, they burn it to ashes. Why would they do that? Don't you know? Keeping books is a great sin. Everything has to be rewritten. Some books here, however, store information that hasn't been changed for one month. Isn't it amazing? That the too short of a time period? What will you do if they find you? They already did. I made sure no one came back. <laughs> that was a joke. I'm in the middle of setting up a sec better security system. Concept is that it might lure you in like an RPG game, but then you'll find yourself unable to go out. Ah, why am I not surprised? You might think I'm being paranoid, but everyone's like that these days. Else, your name. Can I ask your name? Name? I'm afraid I don't have one. How should I call you then? Males of your, our species are called Frei. You call me, can call me that. I thought you brought a girl, but... Okay. Why? Why is it then? You can call me Charlotte. Charlotte. Free one, huh? What? 
It is a beautiful name. I'll remember it. Okay. Come to door come. Welcome. Saving just in case. Saving just in case. Yes, open the door. So, and this time we just go up. Go up. Yes, actually. No, don't touch it. Why are you acting so cautious all of them? We've been here before. Switch the channel and switch. What does that even mean? I don't think I quite understand myself. Feeling that I came back to the exact same place, but some things had changed. Like what? Like, you're still alive. Did I die right here? Your head got cut off. Oh. Then, what should we do? I'll go first. Steph can rewind if I die before my expiration date. Besides, I can't afford losing you again. Then, that's just stupid. The only way out. Because actually it's not the one I put, typed in before, but it's actually. Have a nice day. Yes, I entered the TV and. Uh... Can it do now? Can I do now? Oh, wait. Okay. Um. Base of happiness. That was not the space of happiness. That was the space of what the fish. Way out. Pick a needle in the eye. Uh, this one is clanging at me. Base of. Uh, why? Okay, one bubble here. Okay. Okay. Okay, um... Okay... Box of the black box, no. Blue, yellow. Blue, yellow. Red. Oh, it's dead. That one. Okay, <coughs> so now we go to the Okay, um What? Fancy bro. Nope. 
And the uh, items. items. You can have my old furniture. I don't need it. I attached the approach to my roommate. Oh. Interesting. Can I also use it to well, step those guys? If I need one, I'll just your heart and help to the die. Stick a needle in the. Uh, yeah, I have the save function, and I will take the save function. Uh, please. Okay. The friend unit. Just kidding. Get another position. I thought there would be anyone there. That is a me. I get this. Sending all the bugs, so I guess we'll search for another way out. Nothing, there's definitely nothing to own. Just out of security reasons. Now somehow going back now. Uh, um, Vix is near. Oh no, did I 
Schönes Haufen auf dem neuen Ingress. The rabbit had to fly up. Oh, ah, yeah. I've always wondered what rabbits have inside their valleys. I'm this surprised. It wasn't cousin. I was too late. Because it was just me leaving the boy like a toy she lost interest in. Why, hello, dear guest. Girl touches my cheek with her blood soaked hand. Why are you so sad? Does it hurt anywhere? Come here, I'll sing you a get better song. Pain, pain, go away and come back the other way. Wait, say about of he's not even a person. What are you saying? Ah, I get it. Must have such a channel to make everything right. Hey, who are you talking to? There's no one but me. Next moment, the girl looks at me as if. Let's play hide and seek. I'll close my eyes and count to 60. Make sure you find a good place to hide, or else. You're it. Um. Okay, what? Where are you? Of your mind, can't you see? It's a bad end for me unless you rewind time and that I have to see this feel escape and you know what to do, right? Ah, best way for running in the hallways. Tap, 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 tap. Aren't you? The meat is not yet run, but the body is hollow. Yet another unsing silently for death. This is no good. Not only you've led the girl to a wrong path, you've completely lost control of her actions and been manipulated by her. I cannot congratulate you on such an embarrassment of an ending. I'm deeply sorry for my inappropriate behavior as a puppeteer. I will request you grant me another chance. It's quite a bold request, dear boy. I grant it. However, death can be rather amusing. Try as many times as you like. That's how you get the bad ending. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I'll wait here. You're not going alone, of course. My partner will go with you. That's right. I understand. Uh, just be careful. Take this just in case. Will do. See you later. Uh, well, I now know I could way to go down there. Or wait, it was on the right. So, uh, safe. Yeah. Tick, tick, toe. Okay. Wait a moment, I'll check on Charlotte. All right. Who are you? Hello there. Is it dangerous for a little girl to wander around here all alone? I don't want to watch you know, some ho some horror creepypasta videos. <laughs> creepypasta story videos. I'm waiting for my friends to come back to my side. Is that so? Well, it's a pity they won't make it back before you meet your death in 10 minutes. That'd be bad. Steph will get fired if I die without him by my side. 
Is it all there is to it? I don't want to cause anyone trouble. Well, well. Aren't you a nice chap? But Felix, will he be okay? I'm afraid he'll die shortly after. There's one way to save your friend, however. Something to Charlotte. Is that okay? Got it. Even though you disagree with my methods, still no way to save him, right? I'm too weak to do anything alone. The man pets Charlotte's head. Don't blame yourself for a single for a single thing, shall? Well then. Okay. I'm wasting time here, by the way, please. Sure. Just a moment. Ah, the human body is such a fragile. Excuse me. And just apologize if I accidentally break it, can I? Well then, what do we have here? All this junk is no good. This is not bad, but not the best option either. Such a shame. I'll get this pretty dress dirty. Hi, do you want to play hide and seek with me and my friends? You see, I'm really bored. Let's play a game. Boredom's the worst, isn't it? <laughs> Your eyes, here come the scissors. Who is this person? What was I? I just have to switch the channel to make everything alright. Right? Hey. Don't make me a murderer. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I I I want to to say it again. Ah. Uh, Connection last try again. Yes, please. Charlotte? Felix, Sapphire, here you are. Good thing you're safe and sound. Are you hurt anymore? And what in the world are you stuffing into this incinerator? Ah, the blood isn't mine. When you were away, I figured I'd stuff the meat chunks we saw earlier in here. Is that so? Are you alright? Yeah, sorry for worrying you. Jeez, I was worried about you. But here you are, covered in blood and more obnoxiously cheerful than ever. Well, sorry about that. The face is good. Wait, you were worried about me? That's something new. It sounds like I'm a jerk. Well, thank you for trusting me, Seth. You're truly my friend. I'm a puppeteer, not a friend. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Then you're the best puppeteer ever. Let's go, everyone. Be dead. If... Just because. It's open. What? Hey, are you really alright? You're spacing out. It's nothing. Liar. Fine, you do not have to tell me what happened. Here, take Matt. That's it. Take safe look sand. Let's go in. Right. Show a. Hey Felix, 
Yes. Can you tell me more about what we are looking for? I know I'm not as smart as you, but I'll try to understand. Well, all I know is that the people here are called... ...were created by an oracle, whom they call their god. At least, used to. Videos are extremely powerful, they can alter reality to their will, which most likely resulted in different... But I've gathered every species... Otherwise, they wouldn't look... So, human? Right, to you. Last time I visited, there were much more of them, yet barely met anyone on our way. This place is a mess. It wasn't supposed to be like this. Perhaps something bad happened. Yes, like this. Great, at that yeah, poor thing. Oh, that body. Same. We'd probably look the same to them as well, you know. I'm scared that somehow there's so many of them. So the house one, so the house two. <laughs> Where, you, where, where am I going to go, haha? -ha. Ah. Bird. No one in these rooms, only the car. Oh. Open. Okay. Press. Um. Ah, code. mask obtained one today for free execution puts the cute into execute and also must have for all how do i look but i'm menacing so um Who said a girl's best friend was diamonds? Okay, I will take a little picture out of this because out of this we have super super blue. And with this, obtain the note. Dead. Rod and corpse. It's also dead. I don't want to talk to any of you. Thank you very much. So. Five. Two. Nine. One is born to execute. 
television room. Or is locked. There are air powered guns for an unforgivable fun experience. Weissman gun, barrel so fun. Ha <laughs> ha, that's a good phone. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha, what the fish. Can't sleep, don't count sheep, count on your chain. That's how they portray our. It's beautiful. Just for your information, organs do not have a physical nor a gender. Don't depict the kids no more than a young. He looking cute though. Fight for equality. He will say safe and I will save. Yeah, I heard something behind the door. I hope it's not. Now we are the exchange remember. Keeping body. Body. Dead body. Still alive. Well, well, hello, dear executioner. So tiny, yet you're the ones who came to end the life of our last shot. How ironic. Come forth and swing your blade. Don't make us wait any longer. I'm, I'm very sorry, but we don't harm you in any way. You won't? How come? Well, for starters, we are not one of your... Take off our masks. The girl extends her weak eyes to my face. Just two eyes. You're merely a traveler. Am, am I missing something? We're speaking to a real oracle, the creator of all that exists in this universe. This body is just a dying vessel. It is an honor to meet you. You seem to be a good child. I believe we've known your parent once. Well, calls of blood. You should leave these lands, for we do not have much time left. What about this girl? She can no longer be saved. But we. We wish to be with our children until the very end. But there are only corpses should leave Joel. Right. We, will we meet again? Seek and you shall find. It's now open. So, uh, oh, that's this one. Oh, I have a feeling it'll be the last channel we visit. Well, it might be there, not far. Truth. Hold on. Let's go. I feel like I have to apologize. For what? Many things. Running away, putting you in danger, making you come here. Found what I was looking for. Satisfaction at all. I didn't have the slightest idea of what happened in this place. Still don't. I thought Uncle would recognize my achievements if I wrote a paper on the oracles. A anomalous entity. Yet this oracle and their universe reek of death. I was twenty billion years too late. You must be thinking how meaningless this journey was. Feel free to laugh at me. It's okay. Please stop blaming yourself. Isn't everything in our life pretty much meaningless? We're so tiny, aren't we? Like worms or maggots even. Yet we consider ourselves important and do everything to bin benefit ourselves. Isn't that what's laughable? Besides, I like going on adventures with you. For me, it's like being with a friend. What's up with that pseudo, pseudo intellectual monogram? Don't try to seem smarter than you are, human maggot. Aren't we already friends? If you, if you say so. <clears throat> what are we waiting for? Let's go in.
Applause. Applause. Okay. Welcome, welcome, dear guests. We are waiting for you. Now we can finally have a talk. Well then, did you enjoy the show? Was it not your liking to like the show? Well, of course. All of the worlds you've visited. There used to be an infinite number of channels, you know. Now they've turned into mere recordings of their past glory. If I may ask, what happened to this world? Many things. A long time ago, we used to be called a god, although we never were one. Our own children raised a knife against us. We used to have a thousand hands, yet they cut all of them off. And now, we are powerless. We used to observe the world with billions of eyes, yet they gouged shot every single one of And now, we are blind. We used to walk in leaps and bounds through the walls we created, yet we can no longer take a single step as our legs were taken away. Creations we dearly loved regardless of their deeds destroyed themselves, and now we are alone. Yet we forgave them for their sin, and we forgive you. You see, the universe we've created is dying. Nothing exists anymore. All we can do is indulge in the memories of the past, no matter how distorted they are. We'll fall apart. So, this will this land and those walking on it. That would be troubling. We absolutely have to return home by tomorrow's morning. Well, there's a way, human child. Do you wish to try? What do, I, what do I have to do? Put your hands on the screen, would you? Are you sure about this? Well, there's no other way we can leave. Did you hear the oracle? You would not have listened to me either way, would you? Even though I don't want to cause trouble for anyone in the wind. You are that troublesome person, aren't I? Put my hands on, my, on the screen. Oh my god, that's beautiful. The oracle. No, the god of this world puts their palms to match mine on the other side of the screen. I can only vaguely remember what happened next. I accepted the god into my heart and we walked home hand in hand. Everything that I was became her and everything that she was became a part of me. Together we said goodnight to the dying world. All the life, the planets, the stars, the black holes, even the atoms have ceased to exist. One by one the channel switched off. I'm gonna use my body as a vessel and used up all the remaining power she had to bring us home. Thanks to that, we were able to make it back home safely. While we were away, not a second pass in our world. That was quite a story, my dear. To personally meet an oracle, even a dying one, what great luck you've run into. Well, who would have known? You always have to wear this creepy mask when you see me. I know you're using father's body as a container to talk to me anyway. What? Easy with the tongue, dear. I thought it would be inconsiderate of me to have a chat with you while using someone you know as a vessel. But if you insist... The brother man takes off his mask. Oh, cute! Better now? Yep, much better. Your eyes have such pretty color. Say, Umbrella Man, hmm? do you happen to know the person I met in the TV world? Why are you so, so sure there was anyone there at all? Well, that's because I committed an unimaginable sin, yet I only vaguely remember it, as if I watched it from the side. 
You natively never cease to amuse me. Of course, we had to edit your source code shortly after you came back. You can tell her the truth, can I? You're talking as if we're in a video game. Well, about that. I keep this button. I keep this button. <laughs> Most of the balls are code based, my dear. It is with what? As you say. But why would you do that? Those memories were unnecessary. Remember, we do not want to you to fail your education program. It's already messed up enough with an oracle becoming a part of you. I'm sure Mr. Seth will be greatly upset if you two go around causing havoc when he isn't looking. We both know I'm not like that, sir. Ahem. <clears throat> By the way, I'm rather surprised that you were able to contain a godlike entity without all your life supporting systems collapsing. Probably she was too weakened to do that much damage to my body. Hmm. What has become of them now? We're still sleeping. I wish we had talked more. I mean, after seeing her memories, I still don't know much about her. The oracles, what exactly are they, really? One could compare them to stars, reaching the end of their lives. They gradually lose all their power and become infantile white dwarfs. Think of yourself. Would a good capable... Would would a god capable of creating new life form from zero care for such insignificant beings like you? Are you talking to me right now? <laughs> Good one. Well, isn't it great that you have met a new friend? Now, take your pills and go to sleep. One want you to nod off in your lessons, although they only postpone your unemployment status. Thanks for finding an hour to spend with me. Good night, Mr. Umbrella Man. Good night, little shot. Receive pills. What do you think? See, Paul? I'll take the pills first. Wonderful sea space fish in my dreams. Good night, Charlotte. I hacked my rabbit dog. Good night, Felix. Good night, Umbrella Man and Oracle. Good night, Guardian Angel who watches over me. Thank you for playing. I hope you enjoyed playing this game. I enjoyed making it. See you next time in episode 2, which is happening next week. Okay, um, question now. What the fish was that? <laughs>